So this fairy tale chapter, I was so happy about the ending. Another drag Neo is introduced and I'm so excited. So basically, we don't know anything about Rocky um, drag Neo at all. We don't know anything. But I really think that one, he is not Natsu's real brother. Not at all. He may have the drag Neo last name, but he's not Natsu's brother. I seriously think that Seraph, unless that's Seraph's other brother, if he had another one, which I don't think is likely, I think that Seraph created this guy artificially, meaning that he was created in a lab or something with magic and stuff like that, because I see Seraph being capable of that type of magic and basically making this guy uh, in the spring in 12 to help him out and stuff. And he also does drag Neil last name because in essence, Severus will be his father because he did create him in a lab or wherever it could be. I seriously don't think this is Natsu's brother at all. I just don't see it. I think this is just, like I said, Severus created this guy. And he looks really powerful. He looks like, I think, I don't know if, he didn't have angel wings. But they said something about a white halo and stuff. And maybe he got some... Um, white type of magic, some light magic or something. I can't wait. I cannot wait to see what this guy is capable of. And Mira Jane, when she got hit through the heart, when I, when I was reading that, and I saw that page where August did that, I was just like, I was just thinking for a second. I'm like, is she dead? Is she dead? Then I was like, can't be because you know Hiromashima, he has to have the happy times. Nobody can die type of freaking manga so i was like no nah, she's not that and then we got a fast explanation that brandish actually decreased the um, the wound and stuff so that was great but you still got hit through the heart so it, at the moment of impact it was a decrease like I, I let's not get too technical here but yeah that's that's what happened and then the sister elite thing fromo is one of my favorite characters in fairy tale. I am not joking around with you. Fromo is hilarious. Fro I'm um, from so the other cat, I forgot his name, he says, Oh yeah, it's nice to see sisterly love. And then Fromo's like, but I but she said she had the wrong person. And I'm just face from like Fromo is so innocent as a cat and stuff. I forgot their official names, but whatever. And it's just hilarious seeing Fromo, but I, I'm super excited for that drag Neil and the, and the white hair drag Neil. Um, before this chapter came out, I really thought that was going to be Seraph, a new form or something. His hair will turn white. Or some people are saying not to say might turn white for some reason. But no, it's not none of them. It's um, a new drag Neil. That was, the, that was the highlight of the chapter for me. I can't wait for next week's chapter. And hopefully I can log you. Can we see my boy Agnologia? Because Agnologia is definitely like my second favorite character in Fairy Tale. Overall, I really enjoy this. Um, I was gonna say this character. I do enjoy the character of the new Dragon, you know how he looks. He looks like a badass. But I really enjoy this chapter. And I will have to give it an 8 out of 10. It was a really great chapter for a Fairy Tale chapter. And the thumbnail is made by some guy from DeviantArt. You can check it in the description below um their deviant art and remember to like this video and subscribe for more content like this peace